to. I mean, instead of our baby looking like Zach, it's gonna look like Leonard. <laughs> or Penny, if it's a girl. It's not gonna look... Sure. <laughs> hoping for a son, so just, like, keep that in mind when you're in there. Yeah, just think, little boys, little boys. Hey, would you mind if Raj and I went away this weekend? Well, it is important for you two to keep the spark alive. <laughs> uh, hey, Sheldon, we're kind of in the middle of something. Oh, it won't be a moment. I just need to grab a book off a high shelf, which I can do because I am both tall and smart. <laughs> Sheldon, come home. They don't want to have your baby. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, oh dear, I think I got something in my eye. My piercing blue eye. <laughs> no, I want you to go if you're gonna have fun. I don't want you to go if you're gonna be miserable and ruin it for everyone. <laughs> Which is a long way of saying I want you to go! Okay. Uh, that's my dad. Now remember, do not bring up any baby stuff, right? Not me not wanting one, not you having one with Zach. Got it. And if he brings it up, change the subject to literally anything else. I got it. But not the Cornhuskers. Do not discuss the Cornhuskers. Although I did have a pretty awesome bachelor party planned for this weekend. Really? What was it? Well, I used my NASA connections to get us four seats on that plane that lets you experience weightlessness. <laughs> Vomit comet. That is so cool. Like, I've always wanted to experience weightlessness. The closest I ever came was that time I accidentally set my scale to kilograms. And sit down. Can I get you something to drink? Maybe a beer? Sure, if you're having one. Okay. Why wouldn't you, since you're not pregnant? Um, Leonard wants to have a baby with my ex-boyfriend, Zach. How about those corn huskers? Pretty good, huh? Maybe for you, you threw me under the bus. Oh, I'm sorry. I panicked. He was judging me. What? Now he's judging me. I know. It worked. <laughs> oh, okay. no, 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 wait, wait. I can't. I mean, I want to, but I'm, I'm not supposed to for the next three days. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Mm. All right. Well, I guess I'll just read a little and then, I don't know, go to sleep. <laughs> If you don't want to do this, then why'd you come? To prove to Howard that he doesn't know me as well as he thinks he does. <laughs> Looks like he does. Unless I do it, and then he doesn't. <laughs> why not just be honest? You're right. You should be honest. You owe me $3,000 for those plane tickets to India. Really? That's what you're sleeping in? Oh, you want me to take it off? No. Well, then pipe down and let me read my comic book. Honey, I, I know what you're doing. Just please stop. Ooh, listen to this. Bam. Pow. Take that, Batman. Letting everybody down. Hate disappointing Leonard, but I really hate disappointing you. Oh, Slugger, you can never disappoint me. <laughs> okay, your high school years were a little rough. Yeah. <laughs> Amy. Yeah. There's something out here. Just trap it under a cup, and I'll be there in a minute. I'll try, but it's Leonard. What? Sorry about that. 
There was you sneaking out at night and your boyfriend sneaking out in the morning. I said sorry. That time you got drunk and stole a horse. Yeah, well, I was there, I remember. Parts of it. I had to get out of the apartment. My wife kept trying to have sex with me. Been there. Why are you trying to avoid having sex? Well, we just did it three weeks ago. I was ago. talking to Leonard! I can't go either. Penny's dad is visiting from Nebraska, and I haven't seen him for a while. Oh, that's nice you guys get along. I forget, how does your father-in-law still hate you? He doesn't hate me. He's just disappointed that I'm not any other man on the planet. That's how I feel about Ben Affleck as Batman. Howie, I don't think I should do this. Really? Well, I did not see that coming. <laughs> besides all that, being your dad's the best thing ever happened to me. What about Randall and Lisa? They're okay. <laughs> I just don't want you to miss out. I know. But if this is really what you want, or don't want, I'm on your side. Thanks. But I've done this before, and since you really, really want to go, I'll stay here. Oh, great. Unless you don't want to, because I was right and I do know you. Well, if you really know me, then you know how far I'll go to prove a point. Apparently 34,000 feet that way, then straight back down, up and down, over and over again, until you throw up food you didn't even eat. They are definitely your weirdest friends. Well, if only that were true. Hey, I decided to not go through with this Zack and Marissa thing. Really? You were so excited about it. I know, but, um, I think I was just fooling myself. I, mean, I, I would be heartbroken if I had a kid out there and I wasn't his dad. I know you would. Look, if you like, I know someone who might be interested. No, absolutely not. I'm sorry, my wife says I'm not allowed. 